This is Alan Jackson, and this is his bourbon silver belly. Now, all the marketing materials here are very, very clear that this was distilled for Alan Jackson and not by Alan Jackson. So if Alan isn't making this, who is? I don't know. It smells like maybe they threw it on some staves. It's not super strong though, but overall that kind of artificial oakiness just doesn't smell wonderful to me. I'm not tasting a ton of rapid aging though. Not tasting a ton of aging at all. Whatever it is could have used more time in the barrel. It is easy to drink on. There's nothing super off-putting about it, but this is the first one where I thought it was just below an average bottom shelf bourbon that you could pick up almost anywhere. If you're a big fan of Alan Jackson, enjoy that. Otherwise, probably not worth picking up.